everybody welcome back to my channel hope you're having a great day so today's question is can anatomy and physiology be taken online and the answer is absolutely yes you can and it's legit it it works so is the school accredited absolutely it is the school that I attended is called Portage Learning and they are accredited. They have partnered with a college called Geneva College. And so through that partnership, they're accredited through um, or accredited by Middle States Commission. Courses are taken through Portage Learning, but the transcripts actually come from Geneva College. Um, so like if you plan to transfer uh, the, those credits, to another school, like your home school, um, or or if you um, decide to attend um, a school uh, later on and you want those um, credits transferred, you can do that. So, um, but like you would need to check with the with that school's registrar, um, like the um, the other school that you want the credits transferred over to. You would need to. Um, check with that school's registrar department not not registration department but it's called registrar um you would need to check with them to see if they will accept them so like with some schools um both the a and p um have to be completed so like for me with my experience so i have a home school um and that's the school where i i'm getting my degree with my home school um I had anatomy and physiology trans anatomy and physiology one transferred over and they put it in as a science elective. And so I, at first I didn't understand why, because I felt like it should have said anatomy and physiology one, but it didn't. So once I contacted them and got a better understanding, they were explaining to me that once I finish A and P two, um, then they will change everything over to anatomy, physiology, one, a and P is the same as anatomy and phys physiology, just a shorter way of saying it. <laughs> so they told me that that's when, uh, they will put it in as anatomy and physiology one and two. And the reason being was because at my home school, their a and P classes consist of the whole body. So a and P one consisted of the, the anatomy of the whole body. And then a and P two consisted of the physiology of the whole body where at Portage learning part one consisted of anatomy and physiology of the, of half the body. And then part two was the other half. So once I got that understanding, it made a lot more sense. Do you get college credit? The answer is is yes you you do you do how much is the course i believe i paid about 756 dollars um, for a four credit course um which wasn't which wasn't that bad to me it's about the same um and actually a lot cheaper than some other schools um so i did have to pay out of pocket and and i paid online does Portage uh, award financial aid and Portage does not participate in the federal financial aid um, program. However, they do work by um, keeping costs low um, by like excluding registration fees, technology fees, um, textbooks um and lab fees so i mean you just basically you you have no fees beyond the tuition so that's not bad that's not bad at all um so like you know and i mentioned textbooks so the question is do do you need a textbook and you don't no textbooks are required um all text and video materials are included um, or provided to the student now if you feel like you need 
an actual book in hand, that's fine. They do offer some suggestions for that, but you do not, it is not necessary. And from my experience, even I did have a book um, previously, but I really didn't even use it. I didn't need to use it because the um, the the text, the information and the video material that they gave me was enough. I mean, it was, it's, there was so much information, like a wealth of information. So I really didn't even need to go outside of, of what they gave me. Um, can you register at any time? And the answer is yes, you can register at any time. You don't have to wait for the fall like August or you don't have to wait for spring. Um, the spring semester, which usually starts in January, you do not have to wait. You can, you can start today and you do work at your own pace. They give you a year um, from the day that you complete your first assignment, I believe. They give you one year from that date to to complete the whole course. So, I mean, like I said, you work at your own pace and, and I, I love it. It works for me being a wife, a mom and having so much responsibility and then also having classes from my home school. It worked. It, it, it absolutely worked. So our Portage Learning courses semester hours and um the answer is yes all portage learning courses are semester credit hours um <clears throat> trying to think what else <sighs> hmm i can't really think of anything else right now um but you know like like i stated earlier it it is it is a program it 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 works it's a school um that is legit and it you know it oh the the program so there are modules um there are modules and then after and with each module uh there are labs that goes that goes along with it so um if you look at the the um uh, what is that called oh, i can't think what it's called anyways if you look at once you look at um the coursework i cannot think what it's called anyways if you look at the coursework you you'll look at it and and you'll be like that's it this is it oh this is it, it's not much it doesn't look like much but it actually is and you do have to um pace yourself and just kind of you know not rush through it take your time um because there is it like i said it's a wealth of information um but there are six modules and with each module uh, there are certain labs that go along with it so they suggest that um you do the labs um in accordance with the modules they'll tell you which ones go with which it's pretty self-explanatory um you do have an online instructor whom you can reach out to at any any time any time and my instructor got back to me um pretty quickly um i didn't feel like you know i felt like my instructor was very on time um was very on time um didn't leave me hanging i didn't feel lost um so his support it was a guy his support was there if you're already enrolled at another school uh, where you're getting your degree um and like you're currently receiving financial aid so basically if you're receiving financial aid at another school um, you can check to see if they accept what's called a consortium agreement so basically it's like a written agreement between schools um, so that a student can continue to receive federal aid funds while studying at a school other than um, his or her home school um, so like, you know, uh, the homeschool is the one that will grant the student's degree or certificate. I kind of mentioned that earlier um, in the video. 
Um, but like, so like the consortium agreement is like a, it's like, it's, it's, it's like a, a contractual agreement. And with that, so the, your homeschool will basically open up your financial aid more like expand it. Like in other words, give you a little more funds to cover, um, to cover the cost of the other school. But you do have to pay, you have to pay up front. You have to pay for your course up front at the other school. So you have to come out of your pocket and once your homeschool dispersed like the refunds, like you basically you'll, you, you'll, you'll see, you'll get that back. The money that you paid for the other school, you'll get that back in a refund at your homeschool. So that's what I mean by they'll open it up, open up your financial aid, like expand the amount a little bit more so that you can basically get like, um, like a reimbursement, um, of, of what you paid previously. So, you know, it, it, it works. Um, it, it, it just, it, it, it's so worth it guys. And I, I really wanted to come on here right away. Like this is one of the first things I wanted to talk about after my, my, um, channel trailer. Um, it, because it's just, I feel like it's helpful when, when I was searching, I was searching and I couldn't really find anyone to explain something like this for me. Um, I prayed and I prayed and before I made the decision to even go with Portage Learning, like I had to really get a clear answer from God because I didn't want to get into something that wouldn't work, you know. Um, I really prayed about it. I checked out, I heard about some other schools that kind of offer an online program, but I really didn't get anywhere with it. And, and so I was kind of brought back to Portage. And so I decided to give it a try. I felt like God was saying, try this school, try this school. And God came through. God truly opened up that door for me, um, with Portage. So I just want to, you know, share my experiences. If God did it for me, tr he, he truly, he'll do it for you as well. So, um, I, I, I think, I think that's pretty much it. I hope what I said to you helps. Um, if you have any questions, by all means, go ahead and ask them in the comment section. And, um, in case you, uh, want to check out more, um, check, you know, just check out more. I'll go ahead and put some links down below. So again, thank you guys for visiting my channel. And I do apologize for my eyes just like looking down and, and looking back, you know, looking back and forth between the camera and my, um, my notebook. I was just, I just really wanted to kind of stay on track with my questions because this information is so vast. So, um, it's so broad. So I just wanted to at least try to answer some of the, the basic questions, the, the questions that I had when I was searching. So if I miss anything, please forgive me. And like I said, just, just go ahead and put the questions down in the comment section, um, below. So thank you guys. I hope you have a, a great rest of your day and I will talk to you soon. See you in the next video. Bye.